Hey drummers, Gary Williams is back with another reaction and analysis video. Please like, share, and subscribe. If you're interested in lessons, a cool Facebook group, or some awesome online classes, all that information is in the text box below. Check it out. So today, we're going to be listening to one of my favorite big band drummers with the Count Basie Orchestra. This is a gentleman named Duffy Jackson, and he is fantastic, and we're going to listen to him right now. Duffy Jackson. Once again, the Count Basie Orchestra under the direction of Frank Foster. Obviously an edit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Whoa. Jesus. Choke one down. A lot of fast singles. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Wow! Wow, that was short and sweet and awesome and just amazing. Oh, God, give me the chills. Man, the amount of horsepower that man has got. Good heavens. And he did this like fanning thing where he played a double stroke or where the right hand was playing off of the first tom onto the snare. So tom snare, left hand on the snare. So do get, 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 but you know, fast. And then, man, just in the blistering. <laughs> it sounded like a big, huge ship coming at you. I was just ferocious power. Highly edited. Okay, so um, try to remember this is Whirly Bird Wind Machine. Anyways, I played this chart myself, and it's really cool because it has the big fermatas, meaning the holds at the end where the horn players play, and then the drummer uh, goes crazy, and then another big uh, the drummer goes crazy, and then usually the third one is the last one. And I love how he got up and stopped and looked at everybody and took off his coat and loosened his tie and just tore into it. And the high cymbals, I mean, he's got the regular stuff, but then he had these big high cymbals and very visual drummer. I really liked, enjoyed his personality. I, I, he would have been a fun person to see live. I didn't get to see him live, unfortunately. I did see the Count Basie Orchestra a couple of times. And um, I'm trying to remember who the drummer was. I think it's... Um, Dennis Mackerel, maybe? I can't remember who the drummer was. It's been so many years ago since I saw the band play live, but it was fantastic. I love the Count Basie Orchestra, so my favorite big band is the Count Basie Orchestra with Butch Miles, of course, being one of the drummers I listen to quite a lot. Really, really enjoyed his playing. Duffy Jackson, of course. Sonny Payne being one of my very, very favorite big band drummers. One of the early drummers actually influenced um, Jojo Mayer's pedaling technique because Sonny Payne was a tap dancer and he wore leather soled shoes. So if you ever study some of the Secret Weapons of Modern Drumming Part 2, A Guide to Pedal Technique, Jojo Mayer goes way into when he first saw that group play and then he saw this fast technique with him standing up employing the heel toe method that Buddy Rich used. Steve Gadd was a tap dancer as well and employed that in his pedaling technique. Now it's pretty commonplace. Anyways, that's going off, but his just intense amount of horsepower, it's super high energy level, 
great swing feel at the beginning there. The typical bassy starts out the tune with some a chorus of piano or two courses of solo up front, high hi hat, the first chorus, loose hi hat, and then they did a quick edit. I think they wanted to go through into toward the end when the drum solo feature was happening. So thank you to whoever my subscriber was that sent this to me recently. And well, how about you do Duffy Jacks? And I said, yes, because I had forgotten about him. So keep the suggestions coming. I really like it. Sorry, I'm not a big metal fan, so I won't really be going down that road. Perhaps maybe if it's a drum solo, as long as I don't have to hear the rest of the stuff. No offense, but it's just not my cup of tea. <laughs> so anyways, I hope you liked it. If you did, give me a thumbs up, share it with your friends. Take care, have a great day, and I'll see you on the next reaction and analysis video. Until then, bye-bye.